And here we are, we've got our pasture grass down in our tank now. And you can see it steaming there. We uh, use a metal screen, it's just a piece of hardware cloth. That's hard to see, but it's right on the top. Um, and it helps mush down that grass. And we want to make sure that we've got our pasture grass fully submerged right in there. And you can see we have some bricks that we use to lay on the top. We want to make sure that's fully immersed. Now we're going to do the magic test here. I've got a standard kitchen thermometer that you would stick in a turkey. And I will take it and I will work it down through here. And I'm going to put it right at the water line here. And we're going to make sure that this, it's hard to see it, it's too much reflection. Um, we want to make sure that goes to 140 or above, and we're sitting at 150 right now. And you want this full material to sit at a minimum of 140 degrees Fahrenheit for 30 full minutes. Per the FDA, that's the minimum temperature necessary to kill off all mold spores. Now you can run this temperature up to 212 if you want, and it's going to cost you, you know, that much more um, energy expense to do that, and it's going to give you no um, effective gain above 140. So we like to see a temperature about 150, and we'll keep it in there for about 45 minutes, and it does a great pasteurizing job.